Well, as the debate between state lawmakers and the governor over education reform rages on, Governor Mike Dunleavy releasing an opinion poll today of 810 Alaskans, which he says shows where Alaskans stand. 57% say reform is needed. 33% saying increasing education funding is the best approach. 73% also support charter school reforms. But some law lawmakers are questioning how specifics and the uh, questions uh, how they were worded and if that affected the survey results. You know, one of the big issues with charter schools that we're d wrestling with down here is do you turn over who's running those charter schools and who's authorizing those charter schools to the State Board of Education and take that away from the local communities? I think probably the majority of Alaskans would not agree with that, and that question was not asked in this poll. Governor Mike Dunleavy joining us live from the governor's mansion in Juneau. Governor, thanks for joining us this evening. So what do you think are the big takeaways from this new public opinion survey? Well, I, th I think it shows broad support across the state, no matter what part of the state you're talking about, Mike, for uh, what we call education reforms. And that's really uh, the people of Alaska saying, hey, we support charter schools. We support home schools. We support our neighborhood schools uh, actually doing a, a better job. We also support funding, and that was part of it as well. And so it, it kind of, uh, in, in a way, validates the uh, approach that many legislators have been taking, an approach that I agree with, and that is let's get education reform and funding together in a package you get across the finish line before this year is out. Governor, you faced several questions during your news conference this afternoon about whether the questions in the survey were biased in favor of your positions. What's your response to that, and how much input did your office have in coming up with the questions for this? Yeah, and so, um, you know, you have a limited amount of time to do a poll. This poll was done by Dittman, which is... Um, well, uh, well regarded, well renowned uh, uh, polling firm here in the state of Alaska. It has been for almost 50 years. It's one of the top rated firms in the entire United States. And so we couldn't think of a better firm to actually do the poll. And with an 800 uh, person sample, it is a large, it is a large sample across the state of Alaska. And so there's always going to be folks that uh, will say, well, you should have asked this, you should have asked that. We want to get a general idea as to what people are thinking on these issues, once again, such as charter schools, home school funding. And uh, I, I, think, uh, I think the information uh, came through, what the people of Alaska want. They want, again, both. They want our schools to be able to do better. They want us to expand our charter schools, support our home schools. And again, uh, funding for education is important. So, Governor, there was a student protest last week about your veto of the uh, bipartisan education bill. There's a new bill moving that would have a $680 increase in what's called the base student allocation. What's your number? Is it 680? Is it higher or lower? Well, certainly education needs money. Certainly inflation is, is really uh, eaten into what has been the base allocation for years. And so we, uh, we, we're not opposed at all to uh, more money going into education. We just want to make sure that we get not just the funding side of things, but also any of the reforms that we're talking about. I think this is the year, uh, we were hoping this is the year to do it. We still think there's time to do it. There is a bill, as you mentioned, that was uh, moved out of uh, House Education into finance. So it's ready uh, to make sure all these reforms are in there and an increase to the base student allocation. So I think most, of, most Alaskans, especially when you look at the poll, Mike, uh, they agree with the direction, like I said, that we're going in and many legislators are going in. One last topic. We only have a few seconds left. The House is looking at a bill for a $2,700 PFD. Where do you stand? You wanted more than that, right? Well, sure. I, I, think, uh, I think people know how to spend their money better than government does. I've always been an advocate of following the law on the PFD. We understand that a court case several years ago left this up to the legislature to decide what the final number is going to be. But we'll continue to advocate for the people of Alaska. We've done that ever since we were elected. I did that when I was a senator, and we'll continue to do that in the future. Governor Mike Dunleavy joining us live from the governor's mansion in Juneau. Thanks so much for your time, sir.